Okay, um, you're young, but is there anything you actually want a guy to do in the bedroom to you? It turns I'm you choking. I like that. Actually, I like choking them. You like choking guys. Yeah. Have you? It's not like a like no, a no, violent I know, thing, I know, I know, but I know. you know, yeah. So, have you ever had? Have you've been choked before? Yeah. Have you ever passed out? No. Do you want to be? Do you want to pass out? No. Because a lot of girls would find that interesting. They're into like I think it was Bella Date. It is interesting. I've like nearly, and that mm-hmm. feeling was really nice. But mm-hmm. I've I don't think I would actually want to like fully pass out. But the feeling right beforehand, I think that's what they're really trying to achieve. Mm-hmm. Anything else besides choking and um I mean I'm into some like little bit more kinky stuff, but mm-hmm. other I mean, like realistically choking hair pulling, like that's what most guys are like, Yeah, I can do that, you know? Mm-hmm. Or like they'll do it on their own anyways. And you? What um, kind of fetishes do you have in the bedroom? We're not gonna get into all of that. Spill right? <laughs> Uh, to a d- I just gentleman. I like when guys are so more dominant. I find it very attractive and manly. Um, I don't think I would ever enjoy vice versa. Like if a guy asked me to be like super super like dominant and they were submissive, I don't. I would do it like once in a while if it was mm-hmm. like a boyfriend and like to be nice. Mm-hmm. But like I would find that very unattractive actually. I think like I just like a guy to be super aggressive. Help me, mommy. Like. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, and like also, I feel I like I don't even. That. I don't like I want. Choking is like fine, but I don't know. I, okay, so I noticed white girls don't like it. A bi- okay, like also it. because when they do it, it's like there's like literally, you know, like that's why I hand here. That's so why it's I kind teach of them. Weird. No, uh, that's not choking. Choking is what no, she's exactly. talking about. So it's I almost like lost my lifetime shit. Yeah, I exactly. Like it. So <laughs> then when they do it like that, it's like kind of like is this like play? Is this pretend? No. Like, you gotta get the rough guys. You gotta call him out when you do it, like little bitch. <laughs> <laughs> I can never call them that. Man, I would feel so bad, but I should. I should work on that. Have you guys ever faked an orgasm? I mean, like I'm sure you have or haven't. You've never, because you don't know. Okay. Have you ever faked an orgasm just to get it okay, over? Okay, maybe when I was like younger and like just starting to have sex, but now no. Like if a guy can't, okay, if I say just like an Adderall or something, it, like. I just wouldn't. Mm-hmm. I'd be like, okay, like, let's just move on from this. <laughs> but hard no. Like, a guy should know that he's not giving me an orgasm. And I'm not going to pretend. Because you should you should give me one. How long do you think a guy should last? Is it like a quickie? Like, a, is it morning sex? I think like 20 minutes. 20 minutes? Yeah. And you? The less is okay. Like, it happens. I, I get tired pretty fast. I mean, I, I can't come. So, like, I'm like... You know, like, I'm not trying to, I know that I'm not achieving anything over here, you know, but like, I mean, I like to feel good for as long as I can. And, you know, I don't really have a problem with it. Just as long as he's being safe and responsible about it. You sound like a commercial. (laughs) But yeah, I mean, it's not really a big deal if you do that and you do that. But I mean, if we can keep going after, then that's cool too. Yeah, you definitely need to have an orgasm, I'm telling you. Because once you get your first orgasm, that super long three-hour shit, you're like, no, I can't do that no more. I, I don't, either way. <laughs> you're still young, you're still young. You'll get I over. get tired pretty fast, so it's no problem with me if he doesn't last either. For me, I know you said Adderall doesn't let you come, right? I mean, not all the time, but it's just... It's Same for me, but the harder. thing is, for me, I could have sex for like 12 hours. Oh, because yeah. it doesn't come well, out. Yeah, yeah. And then, 100%. Yeah, and I'm like, okay, they feel good. I feel terrible. <laughs> <laughs> Life's not fair sometimes. <laughs> okay, um, what is your biggest...